Hello everyone and welcome to episode 84 of Cooking with Love. Don't you just love it? I know I do. Anyway, today we're making dinner. That's right, we're making dinner. What am I having for dinner? You're gonna love this. Bacon and cheddar cheese burgers along with Italian style stuffed mushrooms. And it's easy to make. What you do is you get chopped meat, right, and you put it in a bowl. And you get shredded cheddar cheese and you put that in the bowl with the chopped meat. And then you take bacon and you dice it up and you put that in the bowl. And you mix it all up together, you throw in some salt, you throw on some pepper, right? And then you make burger patties out of it. And there you have cheddar cheese and bacon burgers. And you don't have to put the cheddar cheese on top and bacon on top because it's all inside. Rolls? Fuck the rolls. You don't want the rolls. You just have the plain burgers. Then mushrooms. You get some nice mushrooms and try to get portobello if you can. You get some stuffing. You get some spinach. You get some cheese. You throw all that shit together and you put that on inside the mushroom. And there you have these stuffed mushrooms. So what does all this shit look like? We're about to find out. You know why? I'll tell you why. Because it's all cooking right now in the new way of oven. But before we do anything, you know, I'm going to want some more salt and pepper. So, I grab the salt and pepper. And grab it. Okay, now I'm gonna take everything out because everything's cooked. Oh la la, it looks delicious. Okay, burger one. Burger two. And there you have it. See how good it looks? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. A little bit more salt. A little bit more pepper. we needed a knife and a fork would be nice. See I like you guys, you know what I'm saying? That, that's why I'll share this with you. But you know let's get right down into the burger. And if you cook these things about 15 minutes, they're going to come out a nice medium red. Nice and pink in the middle, you know what I'm saying? Fucking awesome. Alright, got to tell you. It came out pretty well. And the key is, like I said, what you want to do, is you want to put the cheese and bacon in the chopped meat. I mean, don't get me wrong, you know, I get the whole putting the shit on top, but I mean, you get more flavor out of putting it inside with the meat. I mean, just look at that, nice, nice, nice medium rare. If you want it well done, I'd say, I'd say put it in, cook it for a half hour, but if you're a medium rare guy like me, 15 minutes is the way to go. The, uh, the mushrooms, like you said, you know, you get some stuffing, breadcrumbs, provolone cheese, I throw in some black olives because I like black olives, you know. It's a shame, though, that uh, I didn't do a cooking video on the French fry pizza, you know. For my friend on Facebook, you saw the pictures from Wildwood. So one reason why I go down there all the time. Romeo's French fry pizza. Romeo's on Pacific. Without a doubt, 
probably the best pizza dab in the Wildwood at Romeo's. So you should check them out if you're ever in the Wildwood. After we do this burger, we'll have a mushroom and see how that is. Definitely top quality. See how nice and clean the mushroom is, you know, nice and white, very fresh. So once again, very good quality. Once again, I did an awesome job doing this. Because what can I say? I'm Frankie Love and you're not. That's why you watch these videos, to see how I cook, so you can make shit as good as I do. I mean, I don't mean to sound cocky, I don't mean to sound arrogant, but I'm a fucking good cook. I'm going to make some broad a happy husband. I mean, but yeah, I'm going to... Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be a happy, yeah, whatever. Yeah, let's put it this way, the broad I marry, she ain't gonna have to cook. I mean, technically she should cook because she is a woman, but, <clears throat> once again, don't matter to me because I'm a dude that likes to cook. Hence, we got 84 cooking videos on here on YouTube. And more to come! But I gotta say, I definitely impressed myself. I wasn't sure how good these burgers were gonna come out. But, they're awesome. They really are. Definitely more cooking stuff to come. Not sure what. I know I gotta get on episode two of uh, Cocktails with Love. Probably do that later this week. That's gonna be dedicated to a good friend of mine, Paulie White. A uh, nice guy. Went to the same high school together. So we can't be that bad. I mean, he's from Woodlawn, but, uh, hey, it's not his fault, you know? All those wood got, Woodlawn guys think they're badass. Don't get me wrong, some are. Most aren't. They all got the mouth, though, I'll give them that. Anyway, I'm going to finish eating my dinner. Once again, it's very simple. Cheddar cheese and bacon burgers. Shredded cheddar cheese and bacon in a bowl with chopped meat. And you make the burgers from that. Use whatever chopped meat you want. I prefer 85% lean. That way, you know, there's not too much fat. Portobello mushrooms. Breadcrumbs. Stuffing mix. Provolone cheese. Salt, pepper. And black olives and you're good to go. And you get a nice meal like this. I mean, you can't go wrong, you know what I'm saying? It's pretty good. Actually, it's fucking great, but that's just my opinion. You know, I value your opinion too, so make the shit and tell me what you think. You have a great day. I'm going to finish enjoying my, uh, what's up to my burger and my other mushroom. Have a great night, or day, depending on where you are. Don't break the love. I'm out. Stay tuned for episode 85 where I'm making I have no fucking idea. I have no I have no fucking idea. It's pretty good. See you next time. Peace.